Welcome back to the Jones Zone, guys. I uh, have for you an article titled Prophetic Evidence for the Dead Sea Coming Alive. I'm just going to read it uh, real quick here. Among Ezekiel's well-known prophecies commonly believed to be allegorical instead of actual is now being fulfilled just as he stated it would 2,600 years earlier. Simply put, the Dead Sea is coming alive. Fresh water is now streaming into this rift valley area that has actually been not capable to support life ever since the devastation of Sodom and Gomorrah thousands of years ago. Very useful merely for drawing vacationers to sample its recovery qualities while floating unsupported. And fresh water fishes have actually now been seen swimming in the surrounding 6,000 sinkholes that have actually opened over the last few years as the sea comprised of 33% salt has actually been regressing. And you can see here in chapter 47 of Ezekiel who prophesies while in exile in Babylon from 597 BC the prophet explains a vision of a significantly deep river streaming from the temple in Jerusalem down towards the Dead Sea bringing brand new life anywhere it streams and supporting the exact same type of fish as those living in the Mediterranean. Ezekiel recorded, he said to me, this water flows towards the eastern region and goes down into the Arabah, the Jordan Valley, where it enters the sea. When it empties into the sea, the water there becomes fresh. Swarms of living creatures will live wherever the river flows. There will be large numbers of fish because this water flows there and makes the salt water fresh. So where the river flows, everything will live. Fishermen will stand along the shore from En Gedi to Inglaim. There will be places for spreading nets. The fish will be of many kinds like the fish of the Great Sea, the Mediterranean. The vision comes in the middle of the latter part of the book addressing the promised restoration of the Jewish men and women both to their land and their Lord. It is strongly believed that the resurrection of a dead stretch of the water demonstrates a time near the end of the age when the fortunes of Israel, long abandoned and maltreated, would be reversed, as shown in its prophetic evidence. This is what the world is now expecting with the Jewish state becoming a significant participant on the world scene with a flourishing economy born out of remarkable development. At the same time, there is a growing activity of those who think that Jesus is the long-promised Jewish Messiah, satisfying the word that when the Jews are ultimately brought back from all the nations to which they were scattered because of abandoning God's ways, they would be bestowed a brand new heart, and just like the Dead Sea, cleansed and sprinkled clean of their sins. You can be sure that all prophetic evidence of Scripture will be fulfilled to the letter Around three-quarters of Ezekiel's predictions, 81% of the Bible prophecies on the whole have already been fulfilled with pinpoint precision. All right, well, there you have it, guys. Biblical prophecy is being fulfilled before our eyes once again, bringing us a step closer, the arrival of Jesus. Praise the Lord. A link of the video is down in the description. And now I'm signing off. Stay blessed.